How you doing everybody? We've come out here into the bush today, just behind my place. Got uh, young Araya with me, which came out on the bike for a little bit. Uh, the reason we're out here, I, uh, I've got a flint, and I'm gonna see if I can start a fire. So it's gonna be a how to light a fire with a flint video, if I can make it work. So I'm just gonna look around and, you know, make it as if we're lost in the bush somewhere and we need to start a fire. But I'm not gonna start the fire out here. I'm gonna start the fire at home in the fire pit. So, might get some dry grass and stuff and, See how we go. I've never lit a fire with a flint before, so this could be interesting. Go and see what we can find. All right, put some sticks in the bag. Oh, there's some good sticks. Can we get some more? Oh, yeah. All right, go get a few more. This sort of dry grass here looks pretty good. I mean, everything is wet. It's been raining in Perth for like a week. Although you wouldn't think that today, given how nice it is. Good girl. So hopefully this grass that's under these trees will be a bit drier than the stuff out in the open. Um, and it'll take a spark. We'll, we'll find out in a little bit. Dry grass in here. Yep, put some dry grass in there. We need some more dry grass as well. Just found this. This is real dry and brittle. So that should uh, light up real nice on top of the dry grass to create a flame, hopefully. Like this stuff here. See that? That should work. Good girl, chuck it in. All right, we just collected some uh, dried grass, or well, the dry as we can, I suppose. But. We've got enough stuff now, we'll go back to the house and see if we can light this fire in the fire pit. But I think first we should go for a bit of a ride and see if we can find some kangaroos or something. What do you think? Yeah. All right, let's go. Yeah, good. Good luck! Right, we just got back from our little bush trip, didn't we, Rai? Yeah. All right, let's have a look at what we got in the bag here. There's the fire pit. Here's a wicked little bag full of goodies. Oh, all right, we've got plenty of dry grass here to try with. I might, um, I might separate everything into little piles so that it makes it a bit easier. I'll do that, hang on, stay there. All right, so I've got some, uh, some dried sticks in here. Dried sticks, some dry grass, some sticks, and a little flint. Little strikey plate thing. I guess all we do is strike it in there and see what happens. Oh, oh. I've done it. I've created fire so far. Now I've got to keep it burning. That's what these little sticks here are for. Oh, that's not going well, Adam. Oh no, I think I'm going to kill it. Well, I've made the fire, can I keep it going is the next question. Oh no, these nice dry bits should burn. I wasn't sure that was gonna take because the grass wasn't exactly super dry. sure about this. I've managed to get it sort of going. Oh, well, there you go. It turns out I can light a fire with a flint with relatively wet stuff around. And then it's just a matter of building up, making it bigger and there we go. It's not going to go out now. I did it. I created a fire with a flint. 
all you people that said I couldn't do it. Suckers. <laughs> that was actually really easy. Stoked. Only way to light fires is with a flint now. Yeah.